Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Naya Slivers. We're in the practice room again against Wilgore. He said he's not in A rank on his little message on the thing. Uh, we'll keep this. We got a gem hide. We got some lords. I like it. No turn one play. That's all right. Uh, so, got to take off this from playing Infect too much. All right. Pass. Is this too loud? feels loud in my ear. I never know where my music's at. Either it feels super loud and it's not, or something. Alright, Blood Cave. So, Rakdos. Could be Reanimator. Very well could be Reanimator. Uh, if that's the case, we'll wait to play that Ash Barons. I'm just going to play out Lords, start getting in for damage. See what happens. We'll grab our planes uh, when it's convenient for us. Another mountain. Alright. Faithless. Faithless. Uh, ooh, that sucks. Okay. Alright. Well, uh, Reanimator does run those spells, so it still very well could be Reanimator. Alright, so now what do I want to do? Now I'll Ash Barons for planes. Put out a planes. And, yeah, we'll, we'll just go predatory. See what survives. Then we can start cranking off. What are you going to do to me? Ah, okay, so this is not reanimator. Let's take a look at this guy. Can't block... Enter you another ally enters another you put a counter on him so it's like an ally deck. Interesting. He can't block though. And he just automatically gets a counter. Okay. Fair enough. And we drew our planes. Okay, well, we'll start. Yeah, we'll just put out a gem hide. Put out a plated. And I do want to get aggro here. Uh, so we'll just wait on the other stuff for now. So knowing this now, they could be playing with like lightning bolts and stuff like that. So looking for another lord or something would be nice here to get out of range of anything like that. Hmm, he's playing with white too. How interesting. Well, let's see what he can pull off here. Uh, I've got uh, a special video planned for tomorrow, something that uh, we haven't done in a long time. Uh, so get hyped for that. Make sure to subscribe so you can get notified uh, when that comes out at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We got a cool arena video that we're going to be doing, so get ready for that. All right, these guys just trigger up the wazoo. That's cool. But they can't block, which is pretty bad for for them. He's going in with this guy, huh? Uh, all right, we'll take it. Pass him back to me. Four cards in hand. We get an Ash Barons. Not exactly what I want to be seeing here. Um, do I want to thin my deck first? I think I will. I'm going to thin my deck, grab another forest. Now we'll go in and winding way. Try to search for another lord or something. Uh, not exactly great, but we'll start putting stuff down. Do I just want more bodies than them? I can swing in for four. Hmm. Or I can swing in for six. I'm probably getting hit for six next turn. I guess I want the extra body. Um, so we'll uh, we'll put him down. Bad winding way though. See if he got any uh, 
combat tricks or anything. Doesn't look like it. Nope, just gonna go to them. Alright. Might as well swing. Getting hit for five. Alright. He's, he's not getting pumped this turn, so that's good. Unless he is. Uh-oh. Create two ally creatures. Well, it's a good thing I didn't block. Those guys would have been buffed like crazy. But these guys are getting buffed like crazy. Uh, so we're getting hit for more than I expected now. What are we getting hit for? Five, eight... Nine? Oh, <laughs> That's nasty. Alright. Time to block. Ugh. I don't like this. Not great draws right now. Not great. Alright. Pass. We're gonna start chump blocking, I guess. Throw a lot of creatures in front of these guys. Four cards in hand still. They have another join the ranks. He'll go to a 7-7. Seven, seven. He'll go to a 6-6. Six, six. Alright. I'm going to draw a couple cards. I think we should have had a faster start on these guys. We got a little unlucky with how we were drawn. Alright, they're going in. They got two mana up. It takes, what, four to do that one? Hmm. Alright. Uh, I am going to start blocking these things. Um, yeah, we're going to block. We're going to try to kill these guys if we can. Got all our mana, so I'll just like do that. Do I want to double block here? Sure. This could be a bad blowout, but I'm kind of ready to move on to game two because it's going to be hard to come back from this unless we get like a good winding way or something. But I'm just hoping for no crazy combat tricks, basically. See If we, if we can get these off the board, then we're fine. Um, we'll see. I'm just worried about going too low on life and then getting, like, lightning bolted or something to the face. Just some kind of crazy, crazy quick spell if we don't block. He needs to get pumped once or twice if he wants to, like, eat a bunch of stuff. Or survive our attack, I guess, our blocks. He just needs to get pumped once. They're sitting. They're thinking. So I'm not sure if they've really got something. I'm just crossing my fingers that they don't. Looks like they do. They're paying costs. Alright, Cloud Shift. Alright, so they're going to bounce him. Okay. He's going to get buffed twice, so they'll eat these. Or once, I should say. Okay. So he'll kill one of my he'll kill my plated. Is an ideal. He shrinks though, which is decent. Actually, he'll kill both, won't he? Yeah, he's gonna. Yep. I always forget that drop when plated drops will lose the extra beefiness. Alright, well we get a muscle. That's fine. Hmm. Now, do I want to start swinging in a little bit? Hmm. Still an awkward position. I can swing for... Almost lethal. Can swing in for 12, but then uh, we've just got one chump blocker. They 
I could take nine, eat one of my lords. Eh, I don't know if that's good trade or not. I would like to get aggro. I'm gonna have to chump block. Alright, we'll go for it. We'll swing out. Double block my lord or just... Alright, that's fine. Okay, they're gonna eat six. And we got one chump blocker. We got him to seven. Keep drawing lands. That's good. They still got four cards in hand, though. That's what I'm worried about. Wonder if they're sitting on another read the bones. Read the bones. I have to block this. I am worried. Another join the ranks, potentially. All right, so get in for four, and this guy will just die. They block two. Ah, we need a lord to win, basically. We need a draw lord to win the game. Lord. Oh. That sucks. All right. Oh, no. We, we need more than just the Lord. My bad. Um, yeah, because we can only hit him for four. All right, pass. Yeah, we'll pass. We'll pass. Unearth. Ugh. What'd they unearth, though? Um, alright. We're gonna go to game two. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine. It's, uh, it's going to be pretty hard to recover from that. Uh, let's see here. Armadillo Cloak might not be too bad. Relic. They do have an unearth thing. I don't know if it's going to be super relevant. We'll just take out a couple blade backs. We want to be fast against these guys. Electricery is going to help for those stinky tokens, but is it worth bringing in? Nah, we'll keep it like this. We'll keep it like this. Yes, give me a good hand. Um, <laughs> we'll keep. It's not the worst. Might be able to get some good provokes with the Hunter Sliver before they can really pop off. Uh, this is good. Bloodfeld's good. This gives us a, a chance here to set up. Yeah, we'll just play out our gem hide. And if it if it survives, we'll we'll try to get our hunter out. Hunter Lord. If it gets uh, edict, so be it.
All right, good. So this is a 2-2. Two -two. Get another planes. Not exactly what I want to be seeing. Let's just get down our creatures. Refill next turn. Hopefully they can't get the Bajuka guy too big. And maybe we can hit a Sinew or something off a of Winding Way and be able to like force a block somewhere. Two, two, three, three. Can't block, so we might as well swing in, right? We'll take it. It's considering maybe a double block, but I, I think what we have going on is, is better. Uh, that's not bad. Let's do this. Give me a Sinew or something. It's not exactly what I want to see, but it's not terrible. So we'll definitely put down one of these. Definitely put down one of these. Uh, this isn't too bad, actually. So we're going to go like this. And the flanking will drop this to a 1-1. One, one. This will drop to a 2-2. Two, two. We've got first strike. All right, cool. Perfect. Provoke. Do your work. Provoke you. And we'll provoke you. And we'll say okay. And we're going to say yes to both. Yes. Yes. Okay. He loses both his creatures, and we've got a really good board right now. Well done, Hunter Sliver. Well done. Or he just doesn't block. Did I not set those up right? Oh, because he can't block. Oh. Duh. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Alright, it's fine. It's fine. We can still, like, double block something and trade off with the first strike anyways. Duh. Wow, I'm retarded. Can't break the rules of the card. We can force blocks unless it says they literally can't block, so. Oh, man. <laughs> well, that's what happens when you haven't played against cards and you don't fully understand your what you're doing all right um whenever enters a battlefield you may gain life equal to the number all right so he gains a little bit of life and his guys get pumped three three four four they gain three life um, so I can double block something unless I can get them out of range, which they can haste. Oh my, that's not good. All right. Goodness. It's pretty gnarly. I get a plus one and then they all get their counters. Yuck. Yuck, yuck. Mm, yeah. I will triple block him, for sure. Doesn't matter if he's swinging with him or not, I'm, I'm gonna trickle, triple block him. Whenever another ally enters. Ugh. So every turn if another ally enters. That's rough. Just gonna pass? Alright. Fair. Fair. Well, we can at least get these off the board, which is nice. Uh, how many do I want to keep back? I can double block here, but it gets pumped. I want to keep back like three to like try to block one of these or at least stave them off. So I guess I could attack him with a 
third. Take a little bit of damage. I need to start getting in there somehow, so we'll do it like this. Provoke you. Provoke you. And provoke you, but we're not going to say okay to you. Or, sure, we'll say okay to that one. Say no to that one. And we will say okay to this one. So those guys will have to block. They'll take two. They're at a healthy life total for slivers. Get out of here, life gain. And yeah, we'll pass with some good first strikers up, just in case they try to go bananas again. I want to be able to maybe get them comfortable to swing in, but it might be hard for them to do at this point. But they just tapped out big for this, so this might be interesting. Because they can't block, and we've got a uh, good amount here. 14 damage? All right. They're scrying for answers. Hopefully they don't scry into a lightning bolt. That'll change the game a little bit. Can we draw another Lord? Really finish off this game? They had a hard decision, I guess. Uh, I should look at what they did. Let's see. They put two cards on top. Okay, so they got another Cleric. And so I'm guessing they drew like a land cleric. So these guys get buffed. They'll gain some more life, which is super annoying, but we're going to make him go bye-bye next turn again. Just passing. All right. Fair enough. Ooh, yes. Okay. Good, 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 good. Very good. So now we're swinging in for, let's see, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. Hmm. Uh, well, actually, we'll, we'll hit for 18 if we do that. I think we'll just play it safe, though, because they can have 11 back on the, on the back swing here. So I think we will... Just told you, let's see. I'm going to hold you back. I'm going to hold you back. We're going to hold you back. We'll get in for nine. Or can we afford to swing with one more? I guess we can afford to swing with one more. Yeah, we can afford to swing with one more. Make you block there. Make you block there. Make you block there. Make you block, make you block. It's just what we gotta do. Uh, say no. Say no. We'll say yes. Say no. Say no. Say okay. Flanking, he'll go bye bye. Go to 11, pass the turn. All right. Whenever Highlander Berserker or another ally enters a battlefield, you may have allies you can drain. Okay, well, that's bad. Uh, that's not good. So now they got a bunch of first strikers, huh? 7-7 seven, seven first striker and a 6-6 six, six first striker. 
Very interesting. Now they gotta be feeling a little brave. So they can hit me for 13. Oh boy. On Earth. Ugh, yeah, this is gonna be nasty. All right. We will just chump lock with the Sidewinder and gem hide, and then we should be able to just hit him for lethal. I mean, you gotta swing in, right? You got to. Go like that. Make them block one thing or no things. Gain one life, go to 12, okay. All right, so I think we won. Just stack these, but we're going to say no to all of them. He can do whatever he wants. We'll let him decide. Yeah, all right. Go to game three. Uh, I think we, I like what we have. Uh, that game would definitely be a lot different if we didn't have that hunter. That hunter definitely uh, saved us quite a bit of damage, that's for sure. And the striking. Striking a hunter combo with this deck was really nice, so um, this is interesting. Let's see if we can uh, get this third win, uh, the second win. Win the match. Let's do it. I have my doubts, though. They got some strong creatures. Some good combos. Maybe I'm not giving Relic enough credit in this matchup, just for the unearth. I don't know, though. Lord Viverlint One Lander. Hmm. I can do a lot with this one land, but I think it's just going to be too, too slow because it's tapped. And this isn't great either. Okay. Wow. 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 That's, that's crazy. I have to put three cards to the bottom? Holy crap. I guess we'll just keep our lords. I want to hang on to Armadillo Cloak. Uh, that's really bad. That's rough. That's that's just game right there. I don't think we can recover from a multi four. That's really rough. That first hand was keepable, but it was just way, way too slow, you know? Uh, our deck doesn't do good with keeping one landers. Uh, we've seen that in the past many a times. Every time I've kept a one lander, I've lost. We don't draw our second land, whatever. And that first hand was a tapped land. Yeah, I can play one thing a turn for a couple turns. Maybe they eat one. Uh, our team doesn't get buffed until we draw that second land. If we do, it's it's a bit rough. It's a bit rough. That's. Yeah, that's, uh, that's a bit unfortunate. Play out our Lord, see if it survives. Again, we're just waiting on a, a planes now. Um, yeah. Uh, that's just unlucky. It's just really unlucky. They could go ham here. Okay, they're just gonna get some life gain. All right, gives me a second to play out a couple more things. They'll hit me for another two. <sighs> we could winding way for land. I think I'll do that actually. <laughs> uh, we're gonna winding way for land. We don't do it often, but when we need to do it. We need to do it. All right, so let's just get out what we can get out for now. 
Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. We'll swing because we're really not going to be blocking next turn, more than likely. All right, we got the lands we need, so uh, now we just need to draw into more creatures. Mm -mm, is it possible to recover? Mm -mm, we shall see. Pardon me, wishes I had kept that. Armadillo Cloak, but uh, that's rough. I was expecting, like, you know, them to kill the creatures pretty fast. They haven't yet. Um, not saying they won't still, but I, I felt like it was going to be a little tough to get an Armadillo Cloak on a creature before it died, and we would probably just fall behind anyways. Uh, when enters the battlefield, gain Vigilance until end of turn. Okay. Gain more life. Everybody gets a buffy buff buff. So we'll get hit for four this turn. Or we could kill their cleric. Hmm. What's more important? I actually might just jump lock here. Um... I think this is more important. Get rid of this buff guy. That is tough. Yeah, let's jump block this. More Ash Barons, huh? Alright. Definitely play a Lord. Play out our creatures. that down swing for three if they want a double block sure we'll eat their patrol no blocks all right creatures from here on out I might even Put a stop in my upkeep. I'm gonna do that actually. I'm gonna put a stop in my upkeep. We're gonna Ash Barons at upkeep before our draw to thin our deck. Uh, Cause I want to draw cre a creature next turn. Uh, I want a less less of a chance to draw land. So we'll we'll grab our mountain, um, and we'll see what happens. All right, they got another one. That's lovely. Well, at least we can block some of these things. We can't block the patrol, really, but if they want to attack in with anything else, we can at least block. Ah, uh, whenever or an ally enters the battlefield, each opponent loses one life, you gain one life. All right, cool. All right, we're going to start getting pinged now. That's not good. And they get another buff. Well, that just makes it super fun now, doesn't it? So now they can swing in with everything. This guy's annoying, man. Take seven, go to seven, block... That's rough. That's rough. If this is their attack, I'm fine with that. Okay, they are going to attack with those. Block here. I don't like the buffs. So we got to watch our life total. Uh, this just gives vigilance. This gives life. We can come back from that. I think this is still our main target. So I'm going to chump block. I don't like doing that. But we're going to do it. They got one card in hand, so this is pretty much their board. All right, so let's cycle. Grab our mountain, just in case. And then go to our upkeep here. Plated. Mm -hmm -hmm. 
take that off now. Play that out. One card in hand. I'm going to pass for a turn. This guy's going to get to be problematic soon. I hope they don't have an unearth. They could go unearth into this guy again. That would be annoying. This is a cool deck. I like it. They're, they're playing really smooth too, which is surprising considering uh, they're rocking the three colors. Okay, that's good. That's good for us. That's really good for us. Alright, let's cycle. Find ourselves another planes. Armadillo cloak. Okay, alright. Now we can start doing some stuff here. I'm going to put it on my plated. Mm -mm. It'll become a 5-6. Very nice. Alright, so we're going to gain some life. Ooh, that was clutch. Clutch Armadillo Cloak. Our sideboard's coming in handy. Our hunters and striking were coming in handy. This is going on a 40-minute game. This is a good game. This is a good match right now. They're like, uh-oh. They can't even believe it. Alright. Excellent. And Trample. I forgot this thing is Trample. Oh, man. I've missed this card. This is why I put it back in the sideboard, guys. This is why I put it back in the sideboard. It's so great. So we'll gain five. Unless he's going to lightning strike this and then block. Ooh, okay. All right, so we're going to take two. That means he's empty-handed, though. They'll gain some life. They'll gain vigilance. They can block this to eternity now if they really wanted to. Uh, so we're definitely going to... If they block with him, we're going to target him. But I don't think they will block with him. If they're smart, they won't block with him. One, two. But they have to if they want to kill this thing. See what happens. They're at 42 health. Oh my gosh. That's insane. No blocks. All right. They could potentially kill me next turn. Um, let's see. They can get in for... We can get in for three. Uh, we just gained, though. We just gained. <laughs> I keep forgetting that we're gaining life now with, with Armadillo Cloak, so... They're running out of time. Five minutes left. Let's see what they drew. We're just swinging in every turn with this plated. That's all we're doing. Oh, man. If we can recover from a mold to four on this, how great would that be? Passing. Oh, you love to see it. That's exactly what you want to see. That's not what you want to see. Just flooding out like crazy now. They can take the damage. Oh, they're going to chump block here? Whoa. I don't know if that's a good play. I don't know if that's good. What trick do you have up your sleeve? Okay. All right, so they'll get triggers like that. Okay, that's, that's cool. Cloud shift that guy. Pop, pop, pop. Hit me for one. Gain more life. All right. Hey, we're just trying to maintain our life total at this point right now. Uh, they may they may run out of time before this game ends, but uh, we've definitely stabilized a little bit. Oh, are we going to get... Okay, alright, cool, cool, cool. Pass to them. Oh, 
Oh, this is this is crazy. This is the these are the magic games you live for. Mold of four on the comeback. Oh, they quit. They quit. They left. Can I see what my card draw is? A plated? A predatory? A gem hide? Okay, we were cruising. We we're gonna get plated predatory, and then we we're coming up on our other armadillo cloak. Ooh. Yes. Yes, dude. I mean they they were had they had four minutes and they <laughs> 38 life, but they're, they're, they can't stop the armadillo cloak, and we were running smooth from here on out. I mean, played it into predatory as beautiful as it is. I mean, that's just great. We were, we were going to have four sixes on the battlefield. This guy was just going to get bigger, too. We came back from Amalda 4. Leave a like on the video if you made it all the way through to the end here. You're a true champion, a true subscriber. Thank you very much for sticking through this awesome gameplay. It was well worth it, I think, even though it was 40 minutes long. But leave a like, leave a comment, uh, supporting the, the nice slivers win here, and stay tuned for more. Like I said at the beginning, don't miss tomorrow's video. It's going to be some good arena fun. Um, and, uh, yeah, we will. Uh, I, I can't believe we did it, but, yeah. <laughs> all right, we'll see you guys in the next video.